Good evening, Galaxy of Heroes. Uh, a smorgasbord, I've probably mispronounced that, of action here. Um, so, what we have is a series of battles, aka my payout climb, um, running predominantly Galactic Republic. I encounter a first for me in on my arena shard. That will come through in a bit. Uh, but here we go. So we're going against a full Sith Empire squad with Shaq T in as the fifth for this Galactic Republic squad. You've seen, I've been running it for a bit. Um, so this one features Bastilla Shan, Fallen, HK-47, Sith Trooper, Darth Revan, Darth Malak. Um, I'm kind of trying to find pure Siths just to, to try them out. Um, I'm willing to bet that people aren't going to put a Grandmaster Yoda in the middle of their Sith Empire squad for either Territory War or Grand Arena or Grand Arena Championship for that matter. Um, yeah. So it does make you wonder, what are you doing? How are you testing if, yeah, because I, I don't know. I, I get it, it's his payout, blah, blah. Um, looks like we could be going through some sort of transition here where um, potentially we're going to lose our testing ground. Um, if the meta is hybrid, and it's not what you're ever going to face in either territory or Grand Arena. Um, yeah, it kind of doesn't neuter Arena, but yeah, you know what I mean? We're just maybe losing, I don't know. Uh, uh, the only thing I can assume there is there's going to be a lot of collaborations between uh, Shardmates. Please put this on, please put that on. Let's try them out just prior to the beginning of events. Um, actually not just prior to the beginning during as well I mean, that's the only way but, well not the only way but the one that seems logical to me so here we start with a defeat uh, the great debate on who's on fifth wow if only someone would do a series of that eh? <laughs> actually damn oh I can re I can reawaken my tag playlist even Cool. Right, we'll do that. I'll add it to... I have a who's on fifth playlist, if you're unaware. Anyway, I digress. So, this is now the uh, same squad that we just lost against, but this time round, uh, instead of Shaq T, we're running C-3PO. Yes, I did watch uh, the McMull vid. Um, I know that he's not the only one. Just Ian also is putting out great content. And apologies for anyone that I've just omitted from that. But, oh dear. Yeah. Um, um, uh, yeah, it, it's been a while. I've been bucking the trend as such. Um, trying out Shark T. She's the new shiny. So, of course, you know, I want to try her out as much as possible. I can get wins. They're more RNG dependent, apparently. Just going by... Um, The McMulvid. Yeah. Oh, oh, we use that. Boom. Check that. That's just beautiful. Wow. Boom. Down. Gone. So, um, yeah, I can see that C3 is probably a far more consistent fifth. So we climb up. So, as mentioned earlier, I now encounter something I have yet to encounter. Another Padme squad on my shard. Oh my word. Am I a trend set? No, I'm not a trend set for my shard, but I've been doing a lot of Grand Republic. No, I've been doing a lot of Galactic Republic. Uh, so, yeah, it makes sense. If you've got them, use them. Definitely use them. Why not? What's the point of having them if you ain't going to get the opportunity of using them as such? So, uh, do I play it wrong? I probably do. I'll go around the houses. Um, I do go around the houses. And, uh, yeah. 
Spoiler alert. <laughs> I may have just given the game away here about the outcome. I do like the way that you know, they heal after getting an absolute hammer in. That was a bit kinky, but hey, whatever. So we're still kind of, yeah. Um, and then, uh, do I make a wrong call? I don't know if I make a wrong call or what. I've just been absolutely stacking their courage. And, oh dear, there goes Ahsoka. Um, we kind of get three of them on the, the rings there almost. All the protection's gone and whatnot. But um, the damage is done, I think. I've already lost. But... I, mean, I suppose the problem here is that I don't think you would mirror match. Um, the squads really kind of work um, against buffing squads, uh, debuffing squads even. Uh, but this one really, really did not pan out. Um, as you can see, boom, arm down. I lost. So, 1 0 to C3PO versus Shakti. There. Caveat being my awful gameplay. So, here we have a, a petulant uh, response. Um, I'll amend that to a very petulant response. Send in the Sith Empire and. Um, I, f I feel like I embrace Sith uh, completely in this match. Boom. Bye-bye, main damage dealer. Wait for it. Oh, there's another one gone. Um, now we're really hammering. Do the AoE. Take him down. Now get annoyed at the fact that C3 is still standing. And um, no, I'm not going to let C3 just back out of this. He's going down. I think I'm getting a money shot from Sith Trooper. Down to one speed. Take it away, Marauder. Petulance done. And so now we move into... Put in Shaq back into the squad. So, I'm wondering, is Shaq a better option if you're encountering a, a Grandmaster Yoda Sith Empire squad? We've got two tunes who are going to remove buffs, one of which will go straight through Foresight, i.e. Ahsoka. I'm loving Ahsoka. Um, and Shaq will hit through as long as there's no Foresight. Boom. Some big hits going on here. Do we... Look at that. Trooper just gone. I'm also now wondering, oh, I mean, that, that hit there, love it. Big AOE, don't get the buff or the, the heal down, so we lose Mr. Beardy. Getting annoyed with the froggy, froggy gone. And now, don't have any restrictions like Revan does in so far as we can't group attack. Oh, yes, we can. Boom, boom. Bring in the buff. We've got healing immunity, ability block. He's on the ropes. He's on the ropes. Can we get him? Still taking big hits. Wow. Still going, and finally, phew, I can breathe again, and we get the win. Up into third, uh, if you can't guess, this is from third to first, 
continue now with the shack. Uh, I'm liking her, and I don't know. I, I mean, uh, this isn't a, a pre-prepared speech. The, the the toughest, well, the most preparation I've done is actually, and grats to me, is getting these videos in the right order. Because uh, believe it or not, I've there's probably about five that, that need to be binned now, edited versions where I kept getting them in the wrong order. Hey ho, that's me. I just need to get timings and everything ready. But I digress. Um, yeah, it's just making me wonder. So is it Shaq for the, for the hybrid arena PVP era and uh, C3 for the tournaments? Tournaments. Wow, showing my age there. For territory war, stroke, not literally, but territory war grand arena. Uh, yeah, probably would be my initial assumption. But um, it's nice to be able to actually have the confidence of going against. Revan Malak. Foresight on me. Still pondering. If you're wondering why my shack has not gained retribution at all, it's because she has neither Zeta at present. Uh, I'm still deliberating. In fact, that's kind of and and not a gnawing question, but a question nonetheless. Do I do her unique? Will that enhance or the opposite? Brain's gone dead. Too much talking. There we go. With the victory. Thank you for watching.